Bismillahirrahmanirrahim I am Muhammad Jahangir Alam Assistant Professor of Indic Silmari Mohila Degree College Silmari Kurigram Dear students, I hope you are well by the grace of Allah You know your online classes are going on Now I am going to deliver a lecture on English second paper for the students of SSC first year on the topic on close. Close, I want to write down on the board. Close, close is a part of sentence which contains one subject and one finite verb. Close is a part of sentence which contains one subject and one finite verb. Close. One subject and one Finite or finite close is a part of sentence which one which contains one subject and one finite verb. You may have a question: What is finite verb? What is finite verb or finite verb? Finite verb is a kind of verb which sits according to its subjects and tense. I want to again say, finite verb is a kind of verb which sits according to its subject and tense. According to its subjects means its number, person, and its tense. So I can write subject plus tense. Dear students, by the close, we can find out we can identify the sentences. So, it is an important part of this lesson. The close, by the close, we can identify the sentence. On the basis of a structure, there are three kinds of sentence. Number one, simple sentence. Number two, complex sentence. And number three, compound sentence. By the close, we can identify the sentences. So, simple sentence bears one close. One close. That means one subject and one finite verb. Complex sentence bears two closes. And compound sentence bears two or more than two clauses.
now i would like to detail i would like to discuss in detail that simple sentence contains one clause that means one subject and one finite verb for example of simple sentence he writes a letter it's a sentence here it is subject and it's finite verb or finite verb that means a close So a clause is a part of sentence which contains one subject and one finite verb. That is a simple sentence because this sentence contains one clause. You may ask, it is a part of sentence. It is the part of sentence. it is a clause but it is not a clause because this is a clause because this part contains one subject and one finite verb and this part there is no subject and there is no finite verb 